boom viewers subscribers back again with these quick updates because trust if it's not foreign from king mix up it's not credible i keep on telling you that and you don't know the things that people bless up on yourself today because we have some serious discussions we need to deal with you know because i don't really know what's going on in jamaica you know what i mean but me see a thing in another newspaper saying that a man was slapped with because he refused orders to remove his security camera from his house Chaja. also cult leader kevin o smith partner in crime that um reddit guy has confessed to sacrificing tanika gardner but yeah what people the court idea with him like l.a lewis you know what i mean and i'm gonna explain what i mean by that in this review but also we need to tackle this vibes cartel thing situation you know that sir p did expose that thing a couple months ago and it looked like it played through in other court but popcorn is still in denial. You see what I'm saying? I'm not here to say if Vibes Cartel did or did not. But some people have sent me some things. How we need to put it out there. Because them I say, oh, daddy, if we stop with two of them, pitney them. How we talking about Tammy Lee and popcorn. But before we get into all of that, people, please hit the like button. Share on our social media platforms. Instagram, WhatsApp, Facebook, and Twitter. Let's get into it. Okay, people, you know the saying, I brought you into this world, and I'm going to be the one to take you out. We all seen the headlines yesterday. Klansman said that Vibes Cartel called him personally to order a hit on a dancehall artist, and everybody is saying it's popcorn based off of Sir P's um, insight he gave a couple months ago. But you know, popcorn is denying it then, and he is definitely in denial now. I mean, denying it again. Um, he texted this earlier this morning and he said, When I stop tag man with Uno Baga Efre, one Baga Yapping. But Popcorn could be playing it smart, people, because you don't know the things that people. Yes, people, we have to think that Popcorn is playing it smart, because remember, things wasn't so sweet for him and certain gaza members when you know popcorn you know them call popcorn an infam a sean star you see me i said so we knew something wasn't right between the camp you know what i mean and you know said popcorn they do interviews saying that vibes cartel they jealous of him you see me i said the same one he did with bbc um extra saying that you know vibes cartel was jealous of him he never said vibes cartel name directly but People them do the maths, you see me, I say, cause people them not slow, you know what I mean, as you can see in the comment sections and things and things. So, um, it, 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 it sounds a way, you know, when a vlogger can, can expose them dealings yeah, that come into court months on later. And it makes me wonder if them are going to slap more charges on Vibes Cartel like they did John Gotti, because, you know, John Gotti always won. In court case, them and the government never liked that, you know, that's why they started calling him the Teflon Don, you know, um, and you see what happened to him, you know what I mean? They took away his, his, his best lawyer and they, they got him, you feel what I'm saying? They kept on hitting with more murder charges after he kept on winning, you see me, I said, so, you know, Owen Ellington's a cartel kill over a hundred people. I know that witness has a cartel out of three hits, you see me, I said. And one of them was allegedly popcorn, according to Sir P. But this wouldn't be nothing new for Daddy One Kill Son if we're supposed to go along with the storyline. Because you remember several years back, I think, um, I don't know how long to be exact. When I can't put it in the comment section, there was a voice note or um, some audio with Tommy Lee Sparta. An alleged somebody that was sent by cartel, allegedly. Um, deal with some contracts or some royalty things and you know that them said Tommy Lee was balling and all of these things upon the audio and I can't go search for it I don't want you see me I said but um, you know it, it was said in other audio that he was sent by the world boss you see me I said so ja no they really making cartel look away you know you know what I mean you know they trying to say he was an informer snitching on people giving up guns and all of these things and and other bad man and all of these things and and i know he's 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 wanted for that's where i'm on a pitney them you see me i say 
Um, me just know so his 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 appeal look like he's finalizing and it look like he's gonna be free based off of some things me see him right in the car. But me just wanna give them update with that popcorn is saying him no one hear nothing with the baga baga yapping, you see me I say Yeah. Yeah, let's proceed. And so people, this is, is giving me LA Lewis types of vibes. Um you know, so the court did order LA Lewis to get psychiatric evaluation and I don't think he ever did, you know what I mean? But now we're hearing that the judges ordered psychiatric evaluation for um this cult member who confessed to sacrificing Tanika Gardner, you see Marison. The lady that gave her life not to Christ but to Kevin O. Smith and, you know, almost gave away her, her life insurance to him too, you know what I mean? But like I said, the man confessed, but they may be charge him as a madman. You see me, I said, I don't think there's nothing crazy about these people, to be honest with you. They know exactly what they were doing. They was killing for murder. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, this is just like gangsters giving orders to other soldiers to slap with people. So I don't know why they're sending him to no psychiatric help. This is just wasting court dollars and all of these things. You see me, I said, but you know, Sam, I'm some big time liar, so you don't know the things that they're going to do all they can to get less time for their client, you feel me? But that's the one, get them updates, you them treating this sane person like L.A. Lewis. Also, another article I'm seeing out of the paper, I'm just one touch base pan lightly, is like, yo, what is really going on in Jamaica? You know what I mean? On a slap where I'm man in a port more because he may remove a tech camera from him horse. It's not like say the man I try to spy upon one of the man just know say him have him premises secured, you know what I mean? If anything go missing, him can't know what I go on, you feel what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Quick quick kinda quint and I had this beer camera all over Portmore, all over Jamaica and it's like where a man like for nothing. Look at them have camera all over England, you see me I said. Like, come on now, y'all are really taking it to the extremes, you know what I mean? Y'all should want to do the crime smarter. You feel what I'm saying? And if I want for doing the crime smarter, instead of you know, just to make the place look like a way, yo. Trust me, I hear, but just I'll give them a quick update while I go on from one at go on, people. Don't forget to subscribe to my other channel. Uh, because we drop a review over there, so you know, with another disturbing story that 11-year-old girl was pregnant, impregnated by a big dirty man, you see me, as an Ayakteen goes live again and responds to Klansman accusations, but the people them in the comment section did a roast him, I call him a lion and all of these things, you see me, as said. But just to give you them update for now, you know what I mean? Don't forget to subscribe, like, share over here as well. Hit notification bell.